Hey guys, welcome. Today we're going to be going through a short tutorial on how to download and install the ROF mod for Arma 3. So, first thing first, you're going to go to the Armaholic page for Arma 3 Sync. This will be in the description. You're going to begin that download, and while that is downloading, you're going to go to the rfnetwork.tv. Um, this will also be in the description. I already have this downloaded, so I'm not going to download it. Basically, all you do is put that in there, hit enter, and it'll start downloading. Alright, so now let's uh, run this installer. Alright, so you're going to want to go ahead and launch the application. Now what you're going to want to do is go up to the top and go to help. Go to auto config and import. So at this point you're going to want to take your ROF config that you downloaded, open that up, and go ahead and drag that to your desktop. So now you can close out of that hit select go to desktop and you'll see that auto config file highlight that and click open hit ok now what you're going to want to do is switch profiles to reavers of fate so now once you go here you're going to go to uh, add on options and you're going to delete this line. So go ahead and highlight it and click the red X on the right hand side. Now you're going to press the plus button and you're going to set a manual path to your Arma 3 directory. Mine looks a little bit different. Um, so mine will be Steam library but yours is just going to be Steam under the program files x86 file. So go to Steam Apps, Common, Arma 3, and then you're set to go. Hit open, and there you go, your path is set. Now you're going to go over to the repositories tag. You're going to make sure that uh, Reavers of Fate Altus Life is checked. Highlight that and click the connect to repository button on the right hand side. After you're connected, it will open up a Reavers of Fate All This Life tab here. And this is where you will check if you have all of the necessary files uh, to run the mod correctly. So go ahead and hit the green arrow which will check for add-ons. And when that's done, if you haven't already installed it or you have uh, missing files that need to be updated or installed, uh, this will be highlighted in red and there'll be uh, an exclamation mark um, on the left hand side of the writing. So then you're going to go ahead and check that and hit the play button. Once the top bar is all the way done, that means that you're mod is finished downloading and next you'll have to go into Arma. Once you get into Arma you go to your expansions tab under config and you find the at ROF mod. Go ahead and click that and hit enable. Once that's finished then you're all set to go. You restart your Arma and you are good to join the game. So thanks for watching guys, be sure to follow to the channel for more videos in the future.